Hi guys, today I made a video where I'm going to show you how to practice jumping from downward facing dog straight into a handstand. So we're gonna come from downward facing dog through a tuck jump. You're gonna bend the knees, look in between the hands and jump into a handstand or into a tuck jump. And I'm going to show you exactly how to work on it, how to slowly get there. So first, you're going to work on your tuck jumps, jumping into a tuck. For beginners, I'd suggest to use a block or practice next to a wall. So if you overflow, the wall will catch you. So the key here, from downward facing dog to jump into a handstand, what you need to do is you need to use enough force to jump and shift your shoulders over the wrist, but at the same time your hips over the shoulders. So as you are jumping here, you are moving the shoulders, but also the hips up, right? So as you come, you are working on two things, shifting the wrist, uh, shifting the shoulders over the wrist and the hips up. For beginners, I'd suggest to maybe shorten the distance because the further your shoulders are from the wrist, from here, the more force you have to use to jump up. If you're standing a little closer, you can start with your shoulders, start with the wrist already, then take a few tuck jumps, or you can just have a little distance, but you know, the further you are with your feet, the more force you need to use. So you can start already with shoulders over the wrist and take a few tuck jumps. If you are bullied, the wall behind you will catch you, right? And then another way of how to practice jumping straight from downward facing dog is to use a block. So first, I suggest to work on getting the shoulders over the wrist and not worry about the hips. So as you come in downward facing dog, you want to put the block somewhere in the, not in the middle, closer to the feet, but not completely. You're going to look in between the hands, Push the floor away from you, keep the arms completely straight, hands also shoulder with distance apart, look in between the hands, bend the knees and just jump over the block. You go back and jump over the block. Try to bring the shoulders completely aligned with the wrist. And then you can slowly, little by little, start taking higher hops. So you want to keep the block, you come to downward facing dog, bend the knees, look in between the hands, and maybe try hopping this time a little higher and bring the feet down. Or you can bring them back behind the block. So you can jump up and come down. Jump up and come down. If you want to work on, jump into a handstand. So you're going to again, look in between the hands, straight arms, bend the knees, look, take a big inhale, and jump up. Big inhale, and you come into a straight handstand, in the same way, you can come down into a downward facing dog. I hope my video will help you to work on your down dog to a handstand transition. Thank you for watching.